So back in the fall, I started streaming Mithril Dragon Trips, basically in hopes of getting two things. One, a Draconic Visage, and two, a Dragon Full Helm, which is pretty much mainly the only reason people go there other than maybe a Slayer task. But I've never gotten a Draconic Visage in my entire RS career, and I believe Mithril Dragons are the second best place to get them. I may be wrong there. I think KBD is the best. I'm not sure where Black Dragons are, but I'm pretty sure Myth Dragons are up there. And as you know, you can also get a Dragon Full Helm as a drop from them, or you can get them from the Chewed Bones, which they drop as well. However, recently, I just really haven't felt like coming back. One, because they're not the most fun thing to do in the world. In fact, they're sort of just AFK as long as you watch your health and they sort of just get boring after a while that's just me some people can stay here for a while and while you do make profit here it's not the biggest profit i could be making money for example at wyverns and having a chance of getting a draconic visage or visage i don't know what the right way to say it is but uh yeah i'm just gonna go ahead and sell you or show you guys my tab and then i'm gonna use my tetsu bones in hopes of getting a dragon full helm i haven't done it yet so I'm just, you know, really hoping it because I don't have any luck on this game and I just want it to change. Before I show you guys my loot though, I'm going to show you what I wear in my inventory setup. So I think for half the kills, I'd use the Serpentine Helm and then for like half of them, I use the Nezi Helm. I can't really remember. I, this has been going for so long. can't really remember what I wear, but this is generally what I wear. I also bring a Super Combat, Extended Nancy Fire, some Pair Potions, Monkfish, and a Ring of Dueling. So pretty simple. I just go to Clan Wars to reset everything and then tilly up to... A Broadband Outpost with the game necklace and just reset the trip, so pretty simple. Here is all the loot. Now, I had 998 total Mithril Bars, which is like 330 Mithril Dragons. I think on some trips I may not have picked them up, but on the right you can see I basically kept track of all the loot. So you can pause it and check it out if you want. But uh, yeah, actually, it's really not that much loot for killing a monster. It's just a bunch of rune items, the Mithril Bars, and then the Chewed Bones. So if we just put it all in, OS Buddy's saying we're going to get 3 million, around 3 million from this. Now, if I take into account the amount of like monkfish per potion super combats i used i'd say that with that three mil i'd probably made about 1.5 mil profit and then that's without the chewed bones though so hopefully we get something good from the chewed bones if i get the dragon full helm we're making you know tens of mils of profit but uh, obviously it comes down to what we get but from the estimate we got three million seventy four thousand so us but he was very close so three mil from i guess the regular drops but the big ones are from the chewed bones well hopefully here we go U logs 10 chewed bones what are we gonna get First one gives us Dragonfall Helm. Four blood runes. Second one is a lovely super attack mix. God bless. Third one gives us a super, I think that's a defense mix. Does anybody even buy those on the GE? Like, who would ever buy these? I, I don't know what the advantage is. Maybe they, they give a bit more attack. I don't, I, I don't know. Fourth one. Oh, I saw red. <laughs> Adamant dart poisoned. Interesting. Maybe those are going well in a blowpipe. Those will sell, for sure. Fifth one. Is that, Adam, is that Adamant Knives? 20 Adamant Knives. Not as good as a Dragon Full Home. Sixth one. What? Noted Renar. Those are actually sort of expensive. I guess I'll take it. But not exactly what I want at all. All right, seventh one. Rune, Runite Bolts. Ten of them. Yo, these should be giving so much more. You know? Chewed Bones are rare. Y you should be getting, like... You know, 15 trident stats from... Okay, that was... No. Eighth one. Seventh. This this is our eighth. Another super defense mix. No. All right, ninth one. Uh... David... Oh, it, got, it gave us 20 more adamant darts. Lovely. Okay, last one. Wow, these went by fast, and I'm not happy. <laughs> Get a fishing mix. It's not even going to sell on the Grand Exchange. Alright, so we're going to sell these. No Dragon Full Elm, but maybe the Fishing Potion will sell for 40 though. Quick price check before we uh, go ahead and sell all these items. Wow, this is so pathetic. Look at that Fishing Potion, 102 GP. <laughs> Mad profit made, guys. Okay, so here I am selling the items. I just fast forward over it. I'm just going to commentate over it. So, as you guys really expected... Nothing special from these chewed bones. It's sort of sad that the only good thing you can get really is the dragon full helm, but we made 38k and the fishing mix just not it's not, it's not selling. It won't sell. I probably will just gonna drink it and drop it. But uh yeah, anyways guys, that's it. Thank you all for watching. So Dragon Full or Dragon No, Mithril Dragons, there we go. Maybe not the best for profit, but I guess I still had fun when streaming. And uh, who knows, maybe I'll go back one day, get myself a dragon full home and a draconic visage. Anyways guys, thank you all for watching. Have a good one. If you want to see more videos like this, make sure to drop a like and a comment. And hope to see you next time. Have a good one. And peace.